for the most accurate forecast in the Ozarks. All right, we're looking at satellite right now here across the United States. All things pretty quiet. There is some activity in the Texas Panhandle and western Oklahoma getting the rain out there. We're going to focus on Super Typhoon Mawar, Mawar down in the Pacific. Here's Guam. Just went through Guam, had a Category 4 storm as a Super Typhoon out there. Typhoon, this is the Pacific's name for a hurricane. So same thing as a hurricane, just different region, calls it different name. It's a typhoon. 140 mile an hour sustained winds going to continue to push off towards the west. It's going to eventually go to the north and east. Make kind of a sharp turn up to the north right before it gets to Japan. So Japan is probably going to see be okay. The storm should just be off the coastline of Japan for them. We'll have to keep an eye on that though. Coming days, watch those headlines. Satellite and radar right now again here in the Ozarks. We're quiet, not stacking any rain or clouds or nothing outside. A few high clouds on the horizon from the high V tower camera. Good looking sunrise though. Pretty mild outside, 61 degrees, winds calm and variable. We've seen several days now, pretty slow winds, and today's going to be right on track with those. Dew point 55 degrees, so humidity low, kind of a comfortable day outside. A little warm later today, though. 55 in Lake Ozark, 59 in Rolla, low 60s, upper 50s. Anywhere across the Ozarks and winds again, another calm day. Winds generally from the east, southeast. We'll see northeast winds develop behind a boundary later on this evening. So temperatures are going to be racing to 80 degrees by midday already, getting to the low to mid 80s already for the afternoon hours. And again, rain chance is pretty minimal. Don't expect anything like that today. A few clouds though in the afternoon when that boundary does pass on through from the northeast. So there's going to be a cold front that swipes on through for the afternoon. This model indicates there could be some spotty rain showers out of this. Don't expect much from this. I think it will be dry today with the exception of maybe a sprinkle here and there, but that would be just about it, if anything at all. Generally just going to see some cumulus clouds blow on by. We're clear tonight for the most part. Some clouds though still lingering for tomorrow afternoon in the west and southwest, but generally a sunny day on your Friday. The weekend looks fantastic, really nice. We're going to be warming up though gradually each and every day back to the low 80s to mid 80s on your Memorial Day itself. Winds continuing to stay light. Winds not being a problem at all uh, this week and even into next week. Things look pretty quiet. East to winds today, 5 to 10 miles an hour, most sunny skies. Front comes through. We're still going to be warm, though. That front's not going to come through till later this afternoon in the evening. Overnight tonight, temperatures on the cooler side, mid 50s to upper 50s, a comfortable, generally quiet evening. There are going to be some clouds out there, so for you stargazers out there, the ones that you would be able to see for tonight would be Venus before 11 p.m., as well as Mars before midnight. There's going to be some cloud cover, though, to contend with. Jupiter and Saturn look to come up after midnight into the early hours of the morning, right before sunrise. May not be as good conditions for those two, but Venus and Mars look like the two winners for tonight before midnight, but there could be some clouds to contend with at times. For Friday, temperatures upper 70s. We're right on track for average. 80s return for the weekend, but still nice, fairly mild and comfortable. Low 80s to mid 80s going into next week. All right, Tom, thanks.